Namaskar brothers and sisters. Before we start talking about some interesting things, America, my friends bikers and all the rest, I must show you first how it looks 10 days later after this incredible snow which has fallen in Madrid. I have to show you how it looks now when the snow is gone and the damage done. All the trees broken. Look at this. Little bit sad view. It's a sad view, isn't it? Today is a nice weather again in, in Madrid. It's about seven, eight degrees and that freezing nights are finished. Some nights were going below seven, eight, below nine degrees, which is absolutely uh, unusual for, for Madrid. But now it's in the night, now it's around seven degrees, which is a huge difference. That's like 16 degrees in only a couple of days. Difference of the temperature, no? You see here, this is a beautiful little park. I come here to do meditation. Look at this tree. Let's find some nice spot. I have to tell you some things today and to read something which is very important. The other day I explained to my friend that this what I'm doing, this is not a commercial channel, will never have lots of followers or viewers or prescriber, prescribers, subscribers, sorry, subscribers, never, because people are just not into spirituality. They want commercial things. I said, if I talk about my uh, biker things and my adventures and uh, I, I could have a uh, hundred thousand subscribers. People love that to be entertained. But I don't want to do that, brothers and sisters. I don't want to do that. I want to do this. This is much more important. This is the heritage I want to leave behind me. I'm sure this video will be watched in the future. Now people just don't have that level of consciousness to follow that, not even to understand it. And they don't realize the importance of, of those words of this science I'm trying to, to present to the people. Of course, I'm not under, uh, against uh, entertainment. That's why I'm showing you a little bit around and what's going on in Madrid and we will talk about bikes. And today I'm going to talk about Americans and bikes and Harley Davidsons. And, uh, and some people I, I met and I like and what's happened, some conversation I had in the recent days. But this, what I'm planning to do now, after finding some place, of course, to sit, it's much, much more important, brothers and sisters. And oh, people who follow me, they are all empaths, actually. They understand me. It's not easy to be empath nowadays, brothers and sisters, at all. And uh, Swadhyaya, this is Swadhyaya, it's called in um, Sanskrit. Spiritual, le spiritual lecturing. 
we have to take that that road brothers and sisters this is the only salvation for us we have no choice this is only way to proceed uh, proceed and what we're gonna talk about today about in, in, in intellect intellect and intuition the highest treasure of human beings distinct from the which distinct them from other creatures is their intellectual superiority. Had there, there been no intelligence in humans, they would hardly be different from other animals. This philosophical consciousness will lead humanity to, the, to greater intellectuality. And this constant pursuit of intellectuality leads one to its furthest limit, where intuition begins. Hence, in the realm of the intuitional practice, it is tremendously helpful. This path of spiritual practice is not devoid of intellect or intuition, rather it is based on intuition. It has no scope for superstition or blind faith. It will facilitate, facilitate the most all-around progress of humanity and manifest the highest human excellence. In the human world, it is not physical strength, but intellectual power that is victorious. The physical strength of the elephant is very great, but a small man goads him with his intellectual power. It is happening in every field of the world. So when human beings enter the inner world, they found that their real wealth lay in increasing their physical strength, psychic strength. And gradually, as their psychic strength increased, it came slowly into contact with spirituality. They found that behind their psychic power, there was another power also working, due to which they attained psychic strength. The human beings invented spiritual practices. They realized that the Supreme Consciousness is everything. Then the idea occurred in their minds. What a great deal of intellect he must possess, from wh whom they derived their intellect. So, for evolution in the psychic level, they should think about him. Ideation on him would increase their intellect. Then the Supreme Consciousness becomes the object of their minds. Unlike the animals, their minds started ideating upon the Supreme Consciousness. Those who are guided by their own intellect and are experiencing the ups and downs of the world realize that their intellect is very small and is unfit for performing greater actions. They they then find no alternative but to merge their minds into the mind of the great. Then their minds will be converted into cosmic mind and whatever actions they perform will be correct actions. Therefore, those who are wise will try to merge their minds into the supreme mind that allow that alone will be the symbol of their wisdom. When one is not sufficiently advanced, one feels to perform actions with one's own intellect. But, wh but when one is much advanced, one begins thinking that one's intellect is not at sufficient for the performance of any action. This is the law of the, of the world that those who possess sufficient intellect say that they have none. But those who have none boast 
that they have a great deal. The means to have much knowledge is to understand that one has no knowledge. Sri Sri Ananda Murti. This is great. It's exactly. The wisest person is the one who says, I know I don't know anything. <laughs> I know I know nothing. That's the old philosophical saying from ancient Greece. So, brothers and sisters, why is important uh, this? Because this is the truth. This is the science. This is what we should learn. And not talk all about material things and, and uh, ordinary and... Yeah, we should enjoy our life. I like motorcycles. I follow some YouTubers. Uh, from states, also from Serbia, Croatia. Very nice, lovely people. I, I have to say hello to my dear friend from Alabama. This video I will dedicate to him. I will call it Sweet Home Alabama. I like America. I grew up on the music, uh, Leonard Skinner and uh, all good stuff, Bob Dylan. You know what I'm talking about. And their culture and Native Americans and and I feel a little bit sorry now what's going on. I feel sorry for the people. But the people are also very stubborn. Yesterday I had some conversation with, an, with another bikers. Uh, Plowboy's ghost, he is a cowboy. He is not really a biker. He's into arms, you know, from Wild West, cold Winchester. I'm very jealous about that Winchester, he's got, if he's watching this video, I, I'm telling him again, well, man, I would love to grab that rifle from you and keep it for myself, it's a nice little shiny thing, but it's all right. But yeah, I'm, I'm uh, in contact with the bikers as well, and chasing uh, Harley, there is one video, yes, uh, channel, yes, I, I, I was watching, and I got a little bit in trouble because my, my, my brother turned up in front of the cameras making videos about some old 1946 knucklehead Harley Davidson with a mask on. And I, I, I just texted him, why are you wearing the muzzle, bro? Of course, immediately some other followers of him storm at me. Like, you should watch the video if you don't like it. And I was after... I, 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 I tried, tried to handle the situation nice and, and, and politely. But in the end, I got a little bit upset. Because the guy told me, if you don't like... Like, he was chasing me away. Like, people started to censor each other. And if that happens among bikers now. So I didn't have a right to say... Look, you should have take that crap off your face. He said, oh, three of, I don't want to die. He said, okay, if they, if they believe in that, it's their right. But I also have a right to say my opinion. I'm doing that for their good. And I, I was not, in, in, not using the word F like some other did. It, it was so so strange situation, so strange situation. I realized we can't do that to each other. We can't censor each other and tell to other people what they should do, what they are gonna say, what comment they are gonna write. Um, th that's terrible. So what is happening now? We in some way we really deserve it because we became so impudent and so intolerant and so stupid and and so naive, then this is inevitable, what's going on, brothers and sisters. But on the other hand, there are some very nice people as well. I mean, these people are probably okay. I just think they're stupid. If you're from America, it doesn't mean that you are clever. I'm sorry, but there are some very nice ones. 
uh, I'm gonna say apart from uh, I'm gonna send my hello apart from uh, uh, Plow Boys Ghost P L O W B O U Boys Ghost. Please check his channel. He's a lovely guy, lovely guy. Sweet home Alabama, my dear friend cowboy. I love him every day more and more. And I had such a nice conversation with him. And I, I'm proud. I'm proud of these guys. I'm proud. They fight for their country. They are real patriots. I send them my best wishes. Absolutely. And to, and to defeat this terrible thing and this false in inauguration. Yeah, yesterday I was talking about, about false in in inauguration. Because the weather was different. On the 20th of January, it was not the same weather, it was cloudy and on the TV we, people were seeing inauguration with nice sunny days. After he was this iron sleepy bee, I don't want to take his talk of, mention his name because it's absolutely disgusting creature, the new pre president, not elected, was signing the first day some orders there like in you know, Oval Office. And it was different to the window. I had some friends that have shown, sent me the photos and I was in shock because the, to the window you can see completely different landscape than the, from the photos when the Trump was sitting at the table, table. You could see some nature trees behind him. People don't pay attention to these details. And where was sleepy Iron B sitting? Behind were like streets, some trucks, cars, completely different landscape, different view to the window. He was not in the Oval Office. It was all staged. And that day was not inauguration. The weather was sunny in, 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 in the videos they presented to the media, has shown to the people. But it was cloudy day, all day. It was not filmed the same day. It is, um, that's what I was talking about that yesterday to these uh, Harley guys. They got upset. Look, they, you can check it out. I didn't imagine anything. I mean, why are pe pe people just can They want to have their hand, head buried in the sand. They don't want to hear about reality. They want to, let's entertain, you know. Oh, wow, Harley, what paint are you going to... Are you going to change the paint of this lovely machine? Yeah, wow, look, this mud guard. I mean, th this is irrelevant. We are in trouble. We have to know the truth, brothers and sisters. We have to, okay, we can love the bikes. We can love everything we want in this world and enjoy this material world. But we have to be aware of what's going on. We have to be aware that we are living in matrix that is completely everything stage, holographic world. The inauguration didn't happen 20. He was not in the Oval Office. Uh, uh, absolutely shocking things. And if somebody says that, even if it's a biker's site, they storm at you. You're the bad guy. What are you doing on this side? Go away if you don't like. You can't chase me. I'm not gonna go away. Plus I'm gonna talk about that now on my channel. And I'm going to send them a link to watch. These people should wake up. What I'm doing is helping. He said, the guy is spreading knowledge and I'm not spreading knowledge. The knowledge is, you know, what year is the, the, the mudguard made? Come on. Come on. They're like children. But let's talk about other ones. Like Mitch, Hard Intentions, brothers and sisters, also recommend. Absolutely lovely guy, American as well. Absolutely lovely. He's a biker. He has his channel. I, I repeat, Hard Intentions. Please check him out. Poor guy. He was al almost innocent. 30 years, 30 something years spent in jail. Incredible story. He was involved in a fight. Somebody else stabbed the guy, not him, but just because he was there, because he was involved in the fight, they, they just, he, take, he had, had to take a ride for more, over 30 years. 
He's a painter, artist. Hello, Mitch. I wish you all the best, man. So, that's about America. I, feel, I, I worry, I worry about them. I don't want any wars. I want love and peace. But what's going on there is absolutely crazy. It's absolutely crazy. I'm very curious to see, you know, what, what, what will happen on the 4th of... The Ma March 4th. I think the Lincoln and Washington, a couple of presidents in the past, when America was still a republic, were in, inaugurated on that day, date. March the 4th. But America is not a republic. It's a corporation. So all this last... 28 presidents were set up. They were, they were the managers of the corporation. America has only 19 real presidents. So, I don't know what's going on with Trump. Is he just playing very well the, 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 his role of the good policeman or he's a little bit genuine? Definitely he's a better than much better than the, the, the new guy, Sleepy Iron B. Sleepy, Sleepy Iron Biden is disgrace. It's absolutely disgrace. Smelling little girl's hair. Oh my God, oh my God. That's why I worry. I worry about these people. I worry about my people. I worry about Spanish. But everybody has his own karma, brothers and sisters. What can we do? If you try to help to the people and then tell them things, and they just turn on you. They just don't want to know. So the best you can do is to leave them alone. You have your karma, you want to get a shot. People start dying, huh? In Norway, nearly 30 people died. In Serbia, 70 doctors died. They obliged them to take the shot. 70 doctors in a month died in Serbia. This is not a joke. I've seen some incredible things. Absolutely unbelievable. But, uh, you know, this channel is about Baba's teaching. This channel is about spirituality this channel is about love but everybody started to 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 a little bit to change the concept of 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 their channels even bikers like uh, uh, scotty scooter tramp scotty he was only talking about his traveling and he started before and now he started to talk about politics basically and 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 plowboy's ghost as well and mitch as well and me as well this was supposed to be strictly spiritual channel maybe a little bit about bikes freedom as as uh, the bikes as a symbol of freedom so that's part of spirituality, freedom. No, the bike is a spiritual machine. But we just can't. Because what is going on is too much. It's so difficult to, to, to keep your mouth shut, brothers and sisters. Okay, that was my little confession. I hope I didn't annoy you too much. But you know, the, the, the life of one empath is very difficult. The empaths, they absorb the, all these energies, all these problems, they absorb like sponge. And they just can't be indifferent. They just can't be like, I don't care, and turn their back. They can't. All empaths are the same. The, most of my viewers are empaths. They will understand me. That's why I love them. That's why I love you. All of you who are watching this. I love you because you, I know you, the people who watch this are special persons. I know. And even if 10 people only see that, I'm so happy. That better to have 10 right ones than 1,000 
zombies, silly ones, who expect from, from me to entertain them. Oh, 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 I don't know. If they want entertainment and lies, they have still TV. They can sit in front of TV and let me watch gossips and sitcoms and stupid Hollywood movies and all day long if they want. This channel is not about that. This channel is about love, it's about truth and about freedom and about people. Very important people, brothers and sisters. This channel is about you. I'm not important. It's a lovely in this park. I feel so good today. Maybe I sound like <laughs> upset or something. No, I'm not upset. But I just can't be quiet and indifferent. Brothers and sisters, I just can't do that. So for, forgive me if I annoy you a little bit. See you soon again. I wish you everything the best. You know I love you. Oops. You know I care about you. My message is always the same. Be good. Be strong. Love each other. Just a second. I have some pro technical problems. Uh huh. Now it's better. Don't waste your time watching silly things on YouTube. It became so polluted. Try to learn something. Turn, turn, go spiritual. Try to meditate 10 minutes with Baba Nam Kevalam or whatever way you choose Buddhist way just con disconnect thinking you don't have to use mantras don't eat meat and of course don't take any shot absolutely not be and tell spread the message to everybody that's a bloody dangerous thing to do so see you soon again I love you Forgive me if I was a little bit <laughs> boring and annoying. I just have to be myself. I have no other way. And please subscribe, share this video. What can I tell you? Follow your intuition. We talked about intuition today. Intuition is very important for us. Intuition is the truth. Intuition never fails. When your intuition tells you something, that's always 100% the truth. So follow your intuition. And be supportive, yeah, to each other. To me as well. Please. I appreciate that very much. Be good. Namaskar.